<laughs> Hi, Garner Nicole with the Sylvia Center. And we already checked the mailbox today, and there weren't any letters. But they did get their very first email. It comes from Aiden, who's two and a half and lives in New York City. Thank you, Aiden, so much for passing along this beautiful painting. Our chickens love it. Our chickens also wanted to read one of their favorite books called Compost Stew. Hope you like it. Compost Stew, an A to Z recipe for the earth by Mary McKenna Sedals, illustrated by Ashley Wolf. Compost Stew. Environmental chefs, Here's a recipe for you to fix from scratch to mix a batch of compost stew. Ingredients. Apple cores, bananas bruised, coffee grounds with filters used. Dirt clods crumbled, eggshells crushed, fruit pulp left behind all mushed. Grass clippings, hair snippings, and an insect or two. Just add to the pot and let it all rot into compost stew. Save jack-o'-lanterns, kitchen scraps, laundry lint from dryer traps. Quarry dust, rye bread crust, and seaweed strands a few. Just add it to the pot and let it all rot into compost stew. Take tea bags plucked from long hot swimmings. Underbrush prunings, vegetable trimmings. Wiggly worms with compost cravings, Xmas tree needles, yellow pine shavings. And zinnia heads from flower beds whose blooming days are through. Just add it to the pot and let it all rot into compost stew. Moisten, toss lightly, cover, let broom. And when the cooking is complete, Mother Earth will have a treat, dark and crumbly, rich and sweet. Now open the pot and what have you got? Compost stew. Me and.